Welcome. This is Judy Julin with WOW Learning Lab. I'm thrilled today to be here with Leon Campbell Jr., who is not only the Chief Inspiration Officer of WOW Learning Lab and the Program Director, but he's also Youth and Family Director of Agape International Spiritual Center, and he's speaking about meeting teens where they are in our Teen Tools and Hope series. Leon, can you give us a little sneak peek of what you'll be talking about? Yes. One of the things I want to talk about is to help our teens develop a healthy self-esteem. Many times the image of what we see in the world does not help us to develop a healthy self-esteem. And that's one of the reasons why you see so much depression and suicides among our teenagers. But I want to first help them develop a healthy self-esteem. And that is working with them to let them know that they're vital, that they're worthy, and that they uh, make a major difference. And they can make a major difference in the world in spite of their age. And that they're not empty vessels to be filled. They didn't come here uh, to be filled out with a lot of wisdom. They came with the wisdom. And our role as parents, our role as educators is to draw it forth. We want to see the butterfly now. Many times we harp upon the caterpillar stage. In other words, you're crawling around here. You're not doing anything. Oh, my God. How'd you do in school? You didn't do well. We're harping upon the things that we don't want and we don't like. But if we begin to see the butterfly, we begin to wait at the finish line for them figuratively. I love that. See begin. the butterfly. And that's just a little glimpse of what Dr. Leon Campbell Jr. is going to be talking about this coming Tuesday, a week from today, May 2nd, from 7 to 8 p.m. PST, meeting teens where they are. You can register now at freedom-teens.ticketleap.com slash teen-tools-and-hope. Join us then. And any parting words, Leon? I look forward to our time together. And it's going to be our own playground for parents and educators. It's going to be a way that we can begin to refine our tools in order that we might have a communication that will give wings to our teens so they think so they, they can fly on their own. Not we have to stand and prop them up or anything, but we give them the tools that they can fly. And, I love uh, that. Give them the tools that they can fly. So thank you, Leon. We'll see you next time.